I'm Rainier. I'm going to show you how to change the blade in your Omni Blender in under five minutes. First of all, I recommend you getting one of these tools. This is the wrench attachment specially designed to go with the base of the blending unit. This will allow you to remove this safely and then put in the new blade unit. First thing you'll need to do is go to your Omni Blender website listed below, depending upon which country you're in, and you can then order the blade unit replacement. You'll also need this wrench, which you can also order. So let me show you. Once you've got these parts ready to go, you'll need a plain glove, a little bit thicker, perhaps a winter glove or something. This one's got a little fake leather on it, so it's a little thicker. You'll need the glove. You might want to have a simple dinner knife ready that has a little bit of weight to the base of the knife unit. And you'll see why in a moment. And also, you'll need a basic towel, like a simple tea towel. Okay, first thing, we need to get the old blade out of the unit. So, let's lay down the towel. The reason why we're using this towel is when the blade unit comes out, it may drop out of the unit and that could damage your tabletop because it is a blade. So, this will protect your table from any possible damage once the blade unit falls out of the container slot. So take your handy dandy blade unit wrench and you'll notice that the base of this has a very specific design to it, which you'll note perfectly fits with the Omni Blender blade removal tool. So that goes in there. Once that is in there, you merely have to twist counterclockwise to loosen backwards. Once you rotate it enough, you'll see that it's quite loose. You'll be able to spin this off by hand, and you'll notice the blade unit will just drop onto the towel. Like that. Now some of you, once you get this retaining ring off, you may find that the blade unit doesn't just pop out and fall onto the tea towel. In which case, what you do is you take an ordinary butter knife and with a little bit of a hefty handle, you can just tap on the blade unit and a couple just simple taps will knock it and it will fall onto the towel. And now we have the blade unit out. This is where the glove's handy. The blade unit can be quite sharp. So I recommend that you use a glove to handle it. At this point, we'll need the new blade out of the box and ready to replace the old blade. So we'll get rid of the old blade and we'll get the new one out of the box. Okay, new blade unit. And again, the glove protects your fingers from the sharp blades. And again, be careful, these are sharp. That's why I'm wearing the winter glove, to protect my fingertips. So take your Omni Blender container and you'll notice that the, the hole here has a beveled edge on it so it's easy to see when you look at the blade unit there's also a beveled edge on it as well. You're going to take this blade unit with the sprocket or the gear facing outward and you're going to stick that up in aligning the bevels and you'll see it'll just fit in only one way and boom it's now sticking out of the base. Take the sealing ring and you're going to spin that on by hand at first just going to kind of get it started. Don't force it, it should go on quite easy. Otherwise you may strip the gears and cause yourself more trouble than you really need to have. There we go. Once it's on, it'll spin easily by fingertip and just get that snug. At this point, you're going to take the handy dandy blade unit wrench, put it in the way it was before, and turn it clockwise this time. You don't have to force it. You should feel a good resistance and just turn it till it's snug. And there you go, your blade unit's replaced and you're ready with a like new container and cutting blades. Hopefully this video has helped you feel confident that you can change the cutting blades in your Omni Blender container yourself with very little effort. If you have any questions trying to change the blade unit yourself, just go once again to the website below and contact Omni Blender and they'll be glad to help you out with any challenges you may face while doing this procedure. Thanks for watching. Hope you have a great day and may all your blending go smoothly.